Well, hello from Newcastle Harbor, and we'll see how long my arm will hold out here. Uh, but we had several great questions from last week's video regarding the uh, data analysis from uh, the last four years of the ARC, uh, particularly the, the catamarans. Um, so if you want to get some info on performance of the uh, performance catamarans versus regular uh, cruising catamarans and all in between, uh, go ahead and take a look at that video. And uh, thought we'd follow that up since we did have some great questions with a call for questions. So uh, several commenters had some great questions and insights onto uh, the data. Uh, one of the recurring themes was a uh, question about motoring and how much of an impact that had on uh, crossing times. And I think that's a great question. I don't know the answer to that, and it deserves some more uh, number crunching. Uh, engine hours are provided as part of the ARC data, uh, so I'm going to go back and look at some of that. Um, another question uh, was regarding the wind directions. Um, and of course, the the ARC goes from uh, the you know Cape Verdes to uh, St. Lucia, and it's you know got the trade winds behind it the whole way. So you're basically sailing mostly downwind, <clears throat> slightly off to one side uh, for most of the sail, unless the weather happens to swirl in an unusual direction. But uh, the question was, do performance catarans deal better when you're trying to sail into the wind? Uh, and I've Got some ideas on how we might be able to answer that question with some real data and uh, hoping to, to do another video on that uh, particular question as well. So while I was at it, I figured let's ask the viewers, uh, please submit your questions for data analysis. If you've got uh, some curiosities, I, I may not be able to answer them. We may not have the data available to answer every question. Um, but uh, since I'm gonna do some number crunching, why not pile on? Um, so if you've got some uh, some thoughts or questions or comments, suggestions, uh, let me know. Uh, put them in the in the comments below, and uh, we'll see you in another couple of weeks with some more updates. Thanks.